Busy Australians are increasingly relying on tap and go to buy everything from lattes to lunches. But convenience comes with hidden costs that can add up to more than you think. It's become the new way to pay. Almost all the time, tap, tap and go. But it's costing more than we realise. Every time you tap, tap, tap uh, out in the shop, you're paying a fee. Those fees are adding up, with Australians forking out around $460 a year. What's going on at the cash register in a lot of shops is not strictly legal, and you could be paying a lot more than you realise. The Reserve Bank sets the guidelines for fees merchants can charge. For credit cards, it's 1.63%, while a purchase made on debit may incur 0.6%, and an FPOS payment could cost the cardholder around 20 cents. Anything above that, you're paying too much. Prompting advice from some finance experts to re-embrace the cash economy. Cash is king. 30 years after ATMs arrived in Australia, there are machines every three kilometres in our major cities. Well, 85% of all transactions are free, so there's no charge now. 15% uh, of transactions incur a fee between two and three dollars. While retailers are permitted to add a surcharge to cards, they aren't allowed to profit from it. But given there's virtually no policing of this in Australia, experts say it's up to consumers to be aware of fees and charges. You have a choice. You can either go and get the cash out or have the convenience of tapping and going. Christy Mayer, 7 News.